Greetings, seekers of wisdom. Welcome to PsycheCraft, your trusted source for self-improvement and personal growth. Our mission here is to provide practical and actionable tips that will guide you on your journey to personal development. Today, we are shedding light on a crucial aspect of this journey, emotional intelligence. This is a key tool we all need to master to thrive in our personal and professional lives. If you find value in our content, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and share this video. Now, let's dive into our topic, Tips for Improving Emotional Intelligence. Emotional intelligence, often abbreviated as EI, is the ability to identify, understand, and manage our emotions and those of others. It's a critical aspect of our lives that influences how we perceive ourselves, interact with others, make decisions, and navigate our emotions in a healthy way. Imagine EI as the compass of our emotional world, guiding us through the complexities of our feelings. When we comprehend our emotions, we can better manage them rather than falling prey to them. It's about more than just being happy or sad. It's about understanding the full spectrum of emotions and using that knowledge to our advantage. EI plays a crucial role in our relationships as well. It enables us to empathize with others, understand their emotions and respond appropriately. It's a fundamental building block of effective communication fostering stronger and more meaningful connections. Understanding emotional intelligence is the first step towards improving it. Now, let's explore how to enhance your EI. Improving emotional intelligence requires conscious effort, self-awareness, and practice. But don't worry, we've got some practical tips for you. First off, practicing mindfulness is a great place to start. It's all about staying present and not letting your mind wander to the past or future. Try to focus on what's happening right now, both within you and around you. What are you feeling? Why are you feeling that way? By asking yourself these questions, you can start to understand your emotions better and respond to them in healthier ways. Next, developing empathy is another key to emotional intelligence. This involves understanding others' feelings, not just your own. Try to put yourself in their shoes and see things from their perspective. This could be as simple as recognizing when someone is having a tough day or as complex as understanding the cultural nuances that shape their experiences. The more you empathize with others, the better you can navigate your relationships. Now let's talk about managing stress. Stress can cloud your judgment and make it harder to understand your emotions, so it's important to find healthy ways to cope. This might involve physical exercise, deep breathing, or even just taking a moment to yourself when things get tough. The key is to find what works for you and stick with it. Improving communication skills is also crucial in enhancing emotional intelligence. This means not just speaking clearly, but also listening actively and responding thoughtfully. Try to really hear what people are saying and respond in a way that shows you understand and respect their feelings. Lastly, don't be afraid to seek feedback. Sometimes we're too close to our own emotions to see them clearly. So ask for input from others. They can provide a fresh perspective and help you understand yourself better. Remember, improving emotional intelligence is a journey, not a destination. So take your time and be patient with yourself. Let's recap what we've learned today. Emotional intelligence is the ability to understand, use, and manage your own emotions in positive ways. To improve it, we've talked about practicing self-awareness, empathy, and effective communication. We've also discussed the importance of learning to manage stress and maintaining a positive attitude. Thank you for joining us today at PsycheCraft. Remember, improving your emotional intelligence can empower you to lead a healthier, happier, and more fulfilling life. Until next time, keep learning, keep growing.